I have a special treat for you all today. I'm gonna to show you how to make the easiest DIY dog sweater that there is. If you find one that's easier to make than this, I challenge you to find it and show it to me. I will definitely share it. Uh, but this is the easiest one I've ever found. So first thing you're gonna do is take an old sweatshirt or a fleece. I like the fleece material. It seems to be warmer and just comfier and snugglier to me. So I chose a fleece. Um, this happens to be an old fleece of my husband's that has a couple of stains on it. We are gonna get rid of it anyway. Uh, you can pick one up at a secondhand shop if you don't have an old one that you're looking to uh, get rid of. But So you're gonna take this, um, and what you can do is measure your dog's length. Start at the um, the wrist, start at the, the beginning of the sleeve, and just measure down uh, to the length of wherever you would want it to sit on your dog, and you can make that cut there. Um, you can trim it up after, too. So what I'm gonna do is just cut right here uh, near the armpit, and I will trim it up once I actually get it on Molly and see what it looks like. So we're just cutting off the sleeve. You can cut the other sleeve off and make two dog sweaters with one old fleece or sweatshirt that you weren't gonna use anyway. So you're gonna take this, um, the sleeve here is what's gonna be what slips over your dog's head. So basically your dog's head's gonna fit through here and then uh, this part's gonna go down his body. You're gonna cut some armholes here and we have to uh, actually put it on your dog and measure in order to do that. So here is our Beagle Molly, and here is the sleeve we just cut, and unfortunately our Chocolate Lab Sadie is here too, and that is her tail you hear jumping on the floor. So I'm going to slip this over Molly's head, <laughs> and Sadie is going to be sassy. And now you can see if you pull it down about where you're going to need your armholes to go. So I'm going to take it off Molly, and I'm going to cut those slits. All right, so now the only other thing I meant to tell you is on the back end of it, um, you want to cut the belly a little bit shorter if you have a male dog, um, and that's just so that he doesn't pee all over his new DIY sweater. So pull Molly's ears out, and I'm going to find, oops, got it turned around. So I'm going to find the hole that I cut for this one. It through. Molly has dew claws, so sometimes they get caught. And then we'll put the other paw through. And then we can pull it down. This sweater is a little bit tight on Molly, you can see. Um, I'm going to cut the armholes a little bit bigger. I didn't cut them quite long enough. Um, so I'll cut them a little bit bigger, but uh, if you want to, you can fold the collar down and hot glue that so it doesn't look, um, you know, tattered. Um, same thing if you want to roll the bottom and hot glue it, you can do that. You can add uh, buttons, you can add ribbon, whatever you want to dress up your dog coat. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to email me, Samantha at topdogtips.com. Thanks for watching this how-to guide.